Hey guys, it's MJ the Student Actuary and I think I have found the most colorful actuarial website that you can find online. So they're called Colorfield and they are South Africa's first and largest dedicated liability driven investment manager. And you don't get any more actuarial than saying liability driven. Because uh, that, after all, is what actuarial science is about. It's about matching your assets to your liabilities. But let's let's check out their, their website. How do we go down? We've got best of breed, independence is everything, free of any conflict. That sounds great. Oh, it's changing colors. Check, they even write their formulas. I can't make out those formulas because they are written backwards. Uh, they even write their formulas in different colors. Um, it's not about the market, uh, what else do they say, clarity, it missed unnecessary complexity. I wonder if they have that in their office, they have these like little rainbow, um, they look like the, you know on a Mac when you're loading, it looks like one of those little little things. So these are their, their services, liability driven investment solutions, smart nest, goal based investment solutions, well outcome based, goal based, liability driven, they kind of similar equity management solutions money market solutions okay cool um, our people let's check out their team okay so that's that's their team they even have a colorful giraffe um, that's very interesting um, I like that surname it's almost like he's got economist written in his surname so let's check out Costa Econom I, I don't know how to pronounce it I'm actually I'm terrible with pronouncing everybody's name even my own name that's why I call myself MJ and not Michael because sometimes I say Michael and then that people think I'm saying Morkel or Martin so anyway cool name sounds like economist he's a proud father of twins diehard Chelsea Ooh, do you really want to be investing with someone who's a Chelsea supporter um, then we've got Sean Levitin, Levitin. I'm, I'm actually not going to pr pronounce the names. Oh, we've got to show you what is this guy? This guy is an actuary, MBA, CFA, CIA. Is he like trying to get every letter in the alphabet behind his name? Um, so that that is very interesting. Um, I, I don't see FASA though. I don't see so chief executive actuary. When he says actuary, does he mean he's FASA or not? Um, here we see MSc Actuarial Science, so Masters in Actuarial Science, CFA Chartered Holder. Um, what is he? Also, do the other guys have twins? Yeah. Proud father of twins. Proud father of twins. Um, Liverpool. Ooh. Ooh. I wonder how they get on in the office. How, how does your chief operating officer and your chief executive officer like, how do they see eye to eye when one's Chelsea, one's Liverpool? Um, yeah, I'm not going to try to pronounce that surname. Uh, Actuary with a PhD in finance. That's very impressive. He's got a father of four. These people have a lot of children. That is very interesting. And I keep seeing this table tennis popping up. Maybe that's like an inside joke. Um, also not going to try to pronounce that name. CFA. Um, C I. PM. I don't know what a CIPM is. Principal actuary. He's a smartphone expert but owns a Nokia. Okay. Okay. Uh, he's the Sheldon Cooper of table tennis. They, they do seem to enjoy their table tennis. Um, Gav, Gavson. Terry, uh, yeah, let me not pronounce names. Jim Bunny, uh, New York marathon runner. Also something table tennis. Also, actually, she's got the Sarah qualification, so that's that's pretty cool. That's the Chartered Enterprise Risk uh, Actuary. Uh, you get that by writing subject ST9. It's not such a difficult exam. I managed to, to pass it first time around. Um, but what is nice, it is an international, internationally accepted uh, qualification. Um, portfolio Manager Actuary. When they're saying Actuary, see, this is, this is the thing. Are, are they FASA? So are they fellowship? Um, actuaries or are they associate members or are they currently like what I am just a student a student actuary um, I still have to do the professional course to become an associate and I still have to pass the fellowship exam to become the fellow actuary so I wonder if they they're not saying any of that and he's a father of two cats um, so yeah that is their their website they are based in Johannesburg 
the second best city in South Africa. Um, but come here, come check out their website. It's very colorful. Um, great place to come and say their viewpoints. I wonder if African Rainbow Capital acquires stake in Colorfield. I mean, Rainbow Colorfield. I don't know. Maybe there's, there's a little bit of irony in there. Um, let's see. Colorful National Treasury reforms. A little learning is a dangerous thing. Tinkerbell, Loch Ness, and inflation-linked bonds. That would make a very good YouTube uh, video title. Probably people see it as clickbait. Is that because those three things don't exist? Um, what does it say? Misunderstood asset classes. I should actually read this for my exam. So this is actually a great website to come to. Come to all of these various investment houses or people doing weird and wonderful actuarial things and come to their viewpoints or their blogs and read what they're writing. It will give you a little bit of an insider edge that you can take with you into the actuarial exam. So I'm not just wasting time going onto these various websites. It is really cool to just yeah, see what they're doing and also maybe go follow these people on Twitter. I don't know, but normally if they have something on Twitter, they normally put their, oh no, there we go. I think, yeah, I think we can, does he also have a Twitter handler? Yeah, they do. So go follow them on Twitter. They'll always be posting interesting things and they are actuarial. So yeah, come check out this website, colorfield.co.za. And also another thing I just realized is their, their logo is actually on the little actuarial bag that we got at the convention. Um, I was, yeah, I was wondering what is Colorfield, only really looking at them today. But there we go, that's, oh, they, they also have a YouTube account. <gasps> okay, yeah, there's lots, lots to see on this website, so guys, definitely come and check this website out. I'll see you guys again for another video. Cheers.